What is up, everybody? This is John with Archer Fish. Like I said earlier, I'm gonna be uh, getting out there and trying a new spot today. So, it's not very new. I've been here before, it's just been a while. Um, it is Bowman's Beach on Sanibel. Looks pretty good. Little wind, which I kind of like. Kind of obscures uh, the bait or the lure. Got some live shrimp, some pinfish, and lots of uh, lures. So, obviously I'm gonna throw the old uh, Yozuri and then maybe the no live bait needed three inch uh, thing. So yeah, I'm gonna find a spot. The tide is going out, which kind of sucks, but I'm gonna kind of find a spot and see if we can't catch some snook, beach snook. All right, just had a hit in the trough over here. All right, so I got one hit already on the Yozuri, but nothing happened with it. Just a little, just a, just a bump. And I'm just walking the beach. The water's a little cloudy, which I like. A little wavy, which I also like. The only thing is the tide is going out. The cool thing about this beach is there is a nice little trough there. I'm seeing a lot of bait inside the trough. And I know that it's a little deeper than it is down south. I know there's gonna be snook cruising around. It's just a matter of if they're feeding or not. Got about another hour and a half, maybe, before the sun goes down. So I'm hoping, you know, kind of same as usual, once the sun starts to go down, uh, might get a little bit more active. Maybe I'll switch to the no live bait needed. He's on, something's on it. Unless it was, no, it, it felt light, but he, but he grabbed it. Let's see. Thanks, little dude. All right, so that was cool. A little beach snook on the pinfish. Not what I'm looking for, but hey, it's always nice to get one. So I, I only got a few pinfish. I wasn't sure what kind of fishing we'd be doing today. I should have got more. Last time they were like micro pinfish, so I didn't want to get a whole bunch of little pinfish. Didn't realize they were so big. Next time I should probably figure that out first. But, it, you know, like I said, I'm trying to figure out what kind of fishing we were gonna do. Didn't know if it was gonna be the culverts or whatever. Um, so now that we're on the beach, I wish I had more pinfish, because I have a feeling in about another hour or so, it's gonna get, uh, it could get really good over here. Like I said, the cool thing about this beach in particular is, uh, I think I'm getting bites right now, actually. Hang on. All right, just so you know what I'm throwing here, I got the uh, Star Rod 7'6", medium heavy, I believe. Um, it's great. This thing is very sensitive, very durable. It's so durable, I slammed the tip in my car door, and it did not phase the end of the rod. Now, I don't suggest you do that uh, at home, kids, but it did survive it completely without barely even a scratch. So it's incredibly light. It's strong enough for this type of fishing, but for like pulling stuff out of docks, it's not um, strong enough. And then I got it paired up with the Slammer 3 that I got, and it's just been one of my go-to rods. It's just kind of like right in the mid. You know, I can get good fish on this, I can get small fish on it. The only thing about it is you don't want to, uh, don't want to um, throw lures on this. It does not, it doesn't have the kind of sensitivity that's the lighter rods that I use for lures. You let go, you let go. All right, just had another snook on there. He just threw the hook. It's, it was bigger than the last one, although he wasn't a giant, and he just threw the hook. So I'm down to my last pinfish already, which kind of sucks, because uh, it's just so cool that they're, they're, they're by, I think I'm getting, I might be getting hit right now, so um, anyway. I've also said this many, many times that I'm like, I get so busy trying to make sure I'm filming it that I don't fight the fish and I don't land the fish. All right, I don't know. I've not gotten another hit on the pinfish. It's the last one too. Waves have kind of calmed down too, which is kind of nice. You would think that that would uh, help out, but tide is still going out as well all right all right you ready he's 
got me, he's got me. Does not feel very big, oh wait, oh good fish. Good fish. My, my drag's too loose. Yeah. Come on, dude. There we go. All right, pal. Thank you. It's not the. It's not as big as I was hoping, but. It's still fine. All right, guys, that is probably all. I'm gonna keep casting uh, as we head back. You know, I love the night fishing, but uh, I think my parking meter is up in like 30 minutes. So I might catch a little night snook here real quick, but it was pretty good. I mean, I hooked five fish, landed two, uh, lost three. Um, they just weren't hooked very well. One was hooked well, I just wasn't paying attention. The other two were on lures, they just hit it and didn't land them. But anyway, it was pretty good. Uh, caught him on live pinfish and got a couple of hits on the Yozuri. The Yozuri's killing it right now. I put on the no live bait needed little three inch thing and I'm gonna throw that for the next couple of minutes. Look at this, look at this. Just look how gorgeous it is out here. What a sunset. Uh, I'm gonna keep throwing, but uh, thanks for watching everybody. I really do appreciate your support. Like, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. Check out that last video. Uh, it was pretty cool, um, and I will see you tomorrow.